हेलो गाइस वेलकम टू माय चैनल होप यू गाइस एंजॉय या गाइस टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू शो यू हाउ वी कैन फिक्स डॉट नेट 3.5 एरर इन एनी विंडो सर्वर लाइक 2008 r2 2012 एंड 2012 r2 ओके सो इफ यू गाइस फेस दिस टाइप ऑफ प्रॉब्लम warning when you could time to install as per server in any windows operate windows server okay like 2008 or 12 okay so you guys get this type of user if you are trying to install any as per server in windows server okay so this type of warning you will get if you get this type of warning so how we how we can solve this okay so we have two method for solve this problem one is by using uh, using server server manager interface okay that is easy method and i will suggest you you do this okay and other is powershell by powershell we can also enable dot net 3 point framework using powershell i will discuss in my next video this method in this video i am only discuss how we can enable through asker server manager interface so for this you have you guys have to go on server manager add role and feature select interface feature and then you have to click select and then hit me. okay let's do manual So I have Windows Server 2012. So I am going to show you how we can enable Dotnet 3 point in Windows Server 2012 RT. It this is same in 2008 RT also. 2012. If you guys using uh, 2008 server and 2008 RT, so it is same. But uh, in the Windows Server Windows Server 2016, it coming change is there. so which i will discuss in my next video okay you guys keep continue watching my channel for later update okay so for this first if you want to enable dot net 3.5 in any windows server so you guys have to go on server manager this is the icon of server manager you can guys click on here and your server manager will be appear So it's doing something processing for that is finished. Okay. So after that you will you have to click on add role and feature. Okay. When you guys click on this, one new window screen will appear. In this screen, you guys click to next. Okay. And then hit again next. And uh, there you have to select your window server. in which window server you want to enable your dotnet 3.5 okay so uh, here is i have only one server but uh, if you have uh, multiple server installed so then you can select in which server you want to enable dotnet 3.5 okay guys so let's next it next because i have only one so i choose this one and next this one this is role we don't need to enable this we need to enable feature so we will i will go next and you can you guys see that uh, i have already enabled dotnet file so if you guys don't enable this you guys click on this button i show you the uh, other like uh, if i click this one okay so same thing you have to do on this because i have already enabled so i could not uh, enable okay so you guys mp uh, find this uh, place mp this box mp so you have to click on this and then hit next after uh, it will take few minute for install when it will install you get the message it is successfully complete and then you can read on your asker server installation setup okay uh, that guys uh, about to dot net framework uh, in windows server 2012 Hope you guys enjoy this video, and uh, please continue to watch my new channel for update uh, new 
error of export server okay. Thank you guys. Thank you guys to watch my video. If you guys feel this video help you, please like and subscribe my channel.